What's up guys and welcome back to Be for Crypto. Yes, Bitcoin lost the support of the support box, which I was telling you in my previous Bitcoin update. And guys, we're going to find out all the price targets that we have reached and also what can we expect. Are we going to see a bullish move towards the upside? And yes, I found some bullish indication that might tell us that we are going to see a strong move from these areas. Or could we expect some more pain and a further dump towards the downside? We're going to look at all of that in this video. So guys, if you want to find out more, watch the video until the end, smash up the like button and subscribe. You know the deal. And now let's start with the video. <laughs> Welcome back to Be For Crypto and guys, before we're going to start with this content, I want to thank you all for smashing up the like button and subscribing to my channel. And now let's directly start with this content. And guys, we saw that Bitcoin lost the support from this previous support box. And guys, I told you in my previous Bitcoin update that I think that we have a high possibility that we're going to lose this level. And we're going to find out what I said in my previous video. So guys, my first price target, if we are going to break this support box, would be all the way at 19,333. And that is also where we had the previous all-time high of 2018. So guys, this would be my first price target. And if we can't get a strong bounce from these regions, I could expect that we are going to reach the bottom of this trend line, which would roundabout be the 18,800 US dollar level. So guys, you can see that exactly these price targets were hit. We exactly bounced off from the 18,800 US dollar level. And guys, we're going to find out on the daily chart what are the levels that we need to keep an eye on before we go on the lower time frames? And guys, you can see that exactly here, we found a lot of support before, and that could be that we are going to see that Bitcoin will see a bounce from these regions. Because guys, we had a lot of support in these areas. And I think that we are going to see a bounce towards the upside before we're going to retest these levels. And now we're going to go on lower time frames to really find out what are the levels that we need to keep an eye on. On the four hour chart, we can see that we exactly came close to this price target of 18,800 US dollars. We went all the way down to 18,513, but you can see that we have found support exactly here at the 18,800 US dollar level. So guys, what could we expect in the short time frame? I could expect that we are going to retest first of all the 13 EMA, which is exactly at the 19,300 US dollar level, which is also our previous all time high from 2019. So guys, after that, we have to see if Bitcoin can reclaim this support box and find support in these areas and get a strong bounce towards the upside. But guys, we could expect some major resistance at these levels of round about 19,700 US dollars. Because guys, you can see that previous support that we had in these regions will now turn into resistance. So guys, we could expect that the price of Bitcoin will reestablish the zone from round about 19,300 US dollars all the way up to the level of 19,700 US dollars until we then can say that we are going to see a strong move from these regions and break also the 100 EMA that will be roundabout in these areas. So guys, for the short term, this is our view on the four hour chart. But guys, we're going to find out what is my bullish case or what could be a bullish indication that we are going to see a strong move from these regions. And we're going to look at that exactly now, guys. First of all, I'm going to remove all these drawings and then we're going to zoom out a little bit. We're going to draw a trend line from the high of 25,200 US dollars from the top here all the way to the bottom. So guys, what can we see on this trend line? We had the resistance exactly here, then we dumped all the way down and then we consolidated and got a rejection exactly at this trend line and then we saw a dump even lower. So guys, then we could see that we broke out of this trend line and found support back on this trend line and then we consolidated in the sideways action until we saw this dump towards the downside. And guys, yes, exactly here, we found support exactly on this trend line again. And this could be a bullish indication that we have formed the bottom at this trend line and that we can expect that we're going to see this move towards the upside. 
Because guys, if we zoom out a little bit, then we can see that we have formed this low exactly at 17,622 US dollars. And guys, actually, this is a quite bullish case that we have formed this double bottom. And that is actually quite bullish for Bitcoin, guys. A double bottom is always a bullish pattern. But guys, we are also going to look at the worst case scenario if we're going to see a dump towards the downside which levels could we expect and for that we are going on the weekly chart. So guys on the weekly chart for Bitcoin this is exactly what I mean. We are forming this double bottom and that is quite bullish guys because then we will see the price of Bitcoin in the next weeks move up like this and then we have formed a W which is also a bullish pattern which exactly has a price target if we drag it from the top of the W all the way to the bottom and if we drag it to the potential breakout point we could see a price movement all the way up to the 35,000 US dollar level and that will also be a lot of resistance because we can see we had a lot of support and resistance in these areas. So guys, this would be if we're going to hold this level and if we're going to see a strong move towards the upside. But guys, if we're going to see that we are going to lose these levels and that we are going to see first of all us going back to the previous low, which is round about the 17,500 US dollar level. And if we're going to break this level, I could imagine that we are going to reach the 16,477, let's say round about 16,500 US dollar level. And guys, we're going to zoom out and I'm going to show you why these levels are quite important for Bitcoin. Because guys, you can clearly see that at the moment we are at these levels from the previous all time high of 2018. So guys, at the moment you can see that we are holding this level quite good. But guys, the next support and resistance area for Bitcoin from these levels would be all the way down here at these levels of 16,500 US dollar. Because guys, you can see we had a lot of resistance in these areas. So guys, resistance turns into support. So we could see that the price of Bitcoin will pump from these regions. But guys, we're going to go back on the four hour chart because guys, at the moment, I really do believe that we are going to see a small pump from this bounce of this trend line. So we could expect as the next price target, first the 13 EMA and the price target of 19,300 US dollar level. And if Bitcoin manages to get back in the support box, I could imagine that we are going to reach this resistance area around about the 19,700 US dollar level. But guys, if we're going to see a strong move either towards the upside or towards the downside, I'm going to inform you in my Telegram group. So guys, make sure to follow the link in the video description to my free Telegram group. And guys, make use of the free bonuses in the video description. And guys, make sure to be for crypto. And we see each other in the next video.